I have failed. I have failed to do what I plan to do with the Yeek, and now is to um, defeat Subject Z with a Yeek and get the Mind Slayer unlocked. But perhaps we can still learn a little bit about uh, what this new um, instance is that I'm about to explore the um, Volcanic Caldera. I believe this is a hard instance, I'm not sure. But I'm going to do it anyways just to sort of, you know, show it off. I don't care if this character dies, I've pretty much failed, so there's no real reason to keep going with it. Um, I've got Nox tunes that are slowly affecting you, so I guess I'm going to probably get hurt or something. So I got a turn lane, I guess. Where I want to kill this stuff real quick. Run! Kill quickly! What winding path brought me to this place? I know not. The mists have obscured all passages, all trail. I see but enclosing dominance in the calder ahead. The ashen cauldron of steam lures me, yet repels me. I fear there's a force here that trying to sway my thoughts. What are the rest of my party? Have my friends abandon me? Uh, I got pinned. And this is reducing fire and cold, gives me uh, light radius, the invisibility con. Check it against the other one. Uh, this one only gives me sunny one fire and cold resistance. This gives me other stuff, so not going to keep this one, obviously. Charge! Very linear path. It's probably a good thing because. Oh, did he try and constrict me? Constricted, so I shrugged off constrict. I like this event. Greater Pharos. And he's got a Master Summoner. That's not something I want to be fooling around with. Just him right away. Stun him. Oh, he summoned the tree. Kill him. And start healing up. Oh, that hurt. And I didn't get rid of the Frozen Assass. It's not hitting me, so... He's got one turn left. I fell into a trance, I know not how. Where it rich blossoms or the oppressive heat. I swooned into the grass and the mist swirled over my face, playing out fantastic shapes before my eyes. Dancing ladies strode across the skies, and a row of dwarves stood laughing as their beards flew in the wind. Then I felt the shadow near, and the ladies scattered and the dwarves in terror screamed, their mouths yelling and spilling black petals. I tried to move, but I could, and I froze in fear. I saw the shadow above me, looking down upon me, upon my conscience. It grunted and lurched away. I passed out then, and I have yet to just recovered. I am not sure what to make of this. I wish to leave, but I do not know the way. Only by escaping this mist shall I have a clear view of this land. Yet, each path seems to one unexpectedly. Each step takes me closer to the center, not further. I must make haste from this place. Keep charging. Sun Giant! I'm gonna start rushing and use my towns a little bit more. Not like I, you know, need to wait for it to cool down all that much. I found a body, a fellow Florin, by the looks of things. Her face was contorted in horror, her limbs twisted in painful shapes. Yet there was no blood. I see not how she was felled. Was it the shadow? I buried her at best I could. There are strange things in this land, I've, and, I've, and I am afeard. I saw a large ant earlier, and when I tried to stomp it underfoot, it screamed at me and called me names. I crushed it, and its eyes went, went red and burst, and it let out a shrill death cry that still echoes through my scowl, scowling my thoughts. My head aches, and with each pound, the earth visibly shakes beneath my feet. 
Is this a fever? I must get out of here. Keep charging. Yeah, good thing I kept my talents on. Oh, look at that. And here we are, next instance. Gonna do this, um, whoops. Gonna activate this right now. Uh, I don't care about that. And we got ourselves Trance, Spinning Spider. Looks like we're in like a sort of open area, kind of like where we have like the Dicara open areas. Killing Pharos at least. So if I don't have uh, Pharos in the alternate Dicara, I've got this, which is kind of cool. Is this an auto explore? What happened? Noxious fumes have evaded all your body. You suddenly fell into a deep slumber. You feel weak. You feel unimportant. You feel like food. You feel like running away. Uh, I'm apparently a, uh, apparently a frail mouse with uh, no stats. Well, I got a little bit of stats. Let's see here. I've got... Hide in plain sight, I've got stealth, I've got evasion, and I've got nimble movements. And there's a snow cat! Ah, it's scary! Dash this quickly. Can I dash away from it? I don't think I can dash through it, so. I had not played in sight. Do distance stealth, right? Briefly caught sight of me. There's a nurse tiger cat. I'm doomed. Wow, that hurt. Well, what are you supposed to do in there? Looks like when Noxious Fumes like get to you, you start to experience her hallucinate or whatever. There's a black mamba and an anaconda. Uh, let's do this. Stun. I'll take that level. Let's up my weapon mastery. I'll up greater weapon focus over here. Concentrate your blows. Each strike has a blah blah blah. This works for all blows. Even ones of talents and from shield bashes. I'm really gonna want to get myself a better, um, what is it, weapon, I guess, soon, but whatever. I'll stick with the current one for now. Cost now at 50. You're dead. What am I now? I'm a frail mouse again. Panther, snow cat. I have no idea where I'm supposed to dash to. Uh, 
Uh, this way. So what, I just get stuck each time? Oh, it missed me, how nice. I wonder if this is like a maze. Okay, let's see if I can go over here. I realize I didn't use the con this time, I probably should just to get that little bump of HP. Keep running away. And I got stuck again. Activate evasion. And do this. Hide in plain sight. So what am I supposed to do? I guess this is a giant maze you have to try and navigate. I'm dead here. You injured up there? Ugh. There's no way I'm getting around to all these guys. Nope. Is this a passive? No, this is an activated thing. It's got a sustain cost. I guess it won't sustain it just yet, but that'll be something I want to sustain eventually. Drop over there. And actually, come to think of it, so is the shield wall, or last stand ability over here. That's a another ability that's um, something I have over there. Oh, you're elite. That didn't work. Kill what I can here. Mime worm. Whoa, what's a mime worm? It hurt quite a bit. Uh, it's a humanoid. Unique. I guess this is, this is a floor that we're talking about. This tall floor and the eyes are lost in the distance. You feel that he barely sees you. mouse again, aren't we? Uh, you forgot your wife. Find her. Yikulution? What? And lost man. Is that me? Dreamstone. You touch the dreamstone, it disappears. You feel better. Why am I fighting this guy? Cause uh, I won. I feel better. I don't know where I'm going. Stop asking me. I 
Ah, die. I don't have a heal at all. Wonder if they all turn into ghouls if I hit them. I'll just go back and kill, I guess, the rest of them. And you are an or a lost wife. Your wife has been turned into a giant. Blood formed at tires above you. Mucus and slime oozes from her orifices, dripping into the floor. The sight and smell makes you wretch. That's actually an orc mutter um, sprite there, but for some reason she's been turned into a monster. She's going to take a while to kill, I think. Let's see what happens if I kill her. Do do do. Ow. Nearly died. Do you have anything worth living for? Lots and lots of these stones, at least. Ow. At least she's been uh, injured somewhat. Don't worry, wifey. I will save you. Save you by killing you. He's got 25. 1, 2, 3, 4. As you enter your dream portal, you suddenly wake up. You feel good. Alright, let's see if I can deal with this Floran. Because you are not good. You are deadly. Rush. I dazed him. Hits me for a little bit of damage, but whatever. Let's do a stun. He activated his shield on himself. Let's see if we can get through that easily enough. Um, he put on a resonance field of some sort. Don't know what that does. Hit it once. And he hit me with that again. Let's activate this. And I will do that. Do this. That didn't do anything. To all, one, two, three, four. You hit me with something there, but whatever. Let's start healing up. Let's stun him again. He's stunned again. And let's save our uh, hits on him. All right, hit him again. He's got that force shield on constantly. Don't know what it does, but. As more armor dies, you feel the fumes getting less poisonous for your mind. The Untouchable, the variant jacket is subject to many rural legends. Someone say it was fashioned by an adventurous may turn rogue. Times before spellways, 
but was since lost at all manner of shady garrets, have since claimed it and worn it at one point or another. To fail but live is what means to be touchful, they say. And the star, legend tells a blaze, shining with like a star, fortune material falling from the ground that glows. Broken land, broken thoughts. If I think clearly, the land runs smooth. But my thoughts are not clear, I think. I am here, and here is me, a reflection of my will. Is it my will or any more? Perhaps I am a reflection. My actions inspired by the mist are about me. My dreams follow me as I wake, and I wake as I follow them. I seek them, and summon them, and play with them. This is my playground now. Whatever I dream shall appear, and when I am tired, I discard them and rend them away. Others want to disturb my games. They, co they come at hawks, and moths, and snakes, and their mouths spill putrid over my busted soil. But let them come. I will play with them. We shall have a fun game together, I think. And what I think is what, I, what is real. Okay, what we pick up? We picked up the star. That's just a da dagger. And we picked up the intoxicable, which is uh, a light armor, which is gives me cunning, defense, armor, and armor penetration. Interesting. And I got something that gets me stunned in freeze immunity. Uh, freeze immunity and lightning resistance are pretty cool, I guess. That could be useful, useful for the Kara. So I guess I'll keep it for that. Keeping you for, you know, whatever. One mine worm down. I wonder what else is left to kill. Looking into the altar, you see, you, um, you will, will let you experience a dream, but should you die in your real body, you might, you might die too. Do you wish to look? Yes, let's see what this is all about. I'm trying to explore in here, right? So if I die, I die, but whatever. Deep slumber. This one again. Okay, let's put on stealth. Do the con thing again. If this is the stats for a mouse, they don't really have much to go for, do they? Poor mouses. You know, I think the map changes each time and gets harder. Yep, oh, it saw me. Um, activate evasion and do this. No longer evading attacks. Two casts down there. One of them saw me. And I'm gonna get stuck again. Don't know why I deactivate that, because now this thing can see me. Uh, he dashes quickly and hits me right away, so. This guy obviously gets a turn or whatever movement. Go here. That's this grass. You can see me too, so. And yeah, he dashed to me. I can use stealth again, but it's not going to help me. Ow. Let's go this way. And I'll use evasion and hope that hurt works. It did. Do this now. Something saw me. The other thing saw me. I'm almost dead. I'm not finding a way out, so I'm assuming I'm dead. So, that'll probably be it for the run. Go like this, or maybe I can get away. Nope. Is that death for me? It wasn't death. That's good at all. No, I did die. So, if I do that, I do die. Well, whatever. That's just the eek dead. That's a little, um, you know, show off of what Dolgraf Calder is. I'll have to read it up and see what it's all about. Hope you guys enjoyed the run with the eek, and um, maybe I'll play another eek in the, you know, in the near future, but for now, I'll try and stick around with the other stuff I plan to play. The next thing I'll be playing is a higher reaver. I'm not too keen on playing the higher order reaver, but, you know, I'll try and show it off just to show it how it works, sort of. 
And that's it for this game.